I'll do with that. All right. Go ahead, BBL. Yeah, checked out again. Yeah, I, I, right. I want to ask you, because going back to you saying you had your fan moment with Roy Jones Jr., when you interviewed yeah. him, did you ever ask any questions that, like, catered to the fact that, you know, after the Montel Griffin fight, he was doing things that was kind of outside the box, like going and fighting two fights in one night, going and playing basketball and then fighting, then going all the way, scaling all the way up to heavyweight and coming back. And how? No, I, I didn't get a chance. It was like 10 minutes. It was like after an event. It wasn't like a real sit down where I could ask. Okay. Like, I got 100 questions to ask Rory, bro. Right. I'm not even going to lie. Yeah, because you know one yeah. thing about Roy, you're going to get the unadulterated truth with him. Like, he don't pull punches and he don't shy away from questions. I love that about him when you're doing an interview. Yeah. yeah. That's why he's one of our favorites. You know, no matter what happened at the back end of his career, I don't really count none of that stuff, but 